Best History World and Affairs presenting Nia Johar, Meriden Totonis, Neil Capital, and Jeffrey Palmer. Breaking news. Our war is not against Hitler in Europe, but against the Hitlers in America, is what African Americans cry during the current war. Discrimination is said to be the cause of the African Americans' distress. They had better privileges in World War I, but they are now under strict circumstances. It is now harder for them to be in the military and serve the country that they love just as much as the whites. Even military leaders put down African Americans by calling their leadership skills not up to par. With that said, training camps were terrible for African Americans because of their segregated mess halls, movie houses, and recreation facilities. The war marshal stated that desegregation would destroy morale, and some of their fellow Americans would rather help the enemy than the African Americans. Due to segregation in the war front and the cities, many African Americans are led to violence causing riots in the North and West. Here in Detroit, a riot broke out with 25 African Americans and 9 whites dead, all because of an attempt to move into the new federal housing projects. Now to Jeff with the live coverage of the riot. Thank you, Nia. Here we have today is Neil from South Detroit. Neil, explain what happened today in the city of Detroit. Well, um, it started out as a search for a place to go home, and then it turned into a really bad riot. There was uh, 25 African Americans dead along with 9 whites. Do you think race is a factor in these riots? Yes, sir. Uh, the race started because of all the discrimination that's been going on. Your views on the riots? Um, it's really horrible. We're, we're at war right now and there's all this discrimination going on. I don't think I can stay here anymore. I only have the South. Thank you, Neil. Back to you, Nia. In other news, thousands of African Americans are migrating away from farms in the South to cities in the North and West. They are in search for better jobs, and as the war continues, employment demands is increasing in all war industry fields. At this very moment, there is an estimated 2 million African American workers in aircraft factories, steel mills, and shipyards. They are helping war efforts for World War II to continue. In addition, for the very first time, African American women are able to find jobs such as domestic helpers and farm laborers. Although they are playing a big part in our society today, African Americans are facing a lot of discrimination abroad and at home. And the government reacts to the situation by establishing the FEPC, Fair Employment Practice Commission. It is ensuring equal rights to African Americans in all war industries. Further on, the U.S. government is re-looking at its own racial policies after seeing the slaughter of many Jews in Europe. This war we are in now is a longer war than we have expected, but African Americans are doing their part to fight for democracy. Well, that's all the time we have for tonight. I'm Mary Dantotanis. And I'm Nia Johar. Thank you for watching APUS World and Affairs. Tune in next time for our next project. Toodles! Bye! And some of their fellow Americans would rather help the enemy than African American. Oops. Do I keep going? Than African. Do I just keep? <laughs> oh my God. Okay. Right. Do this. Go. Is what African Americans. <laughs> Why is this so difficult? Okay. News. Our war is not against Hitler in America, but against. They had better privileges in World War I, but now, but, oh god, in the war front and cities. Many African Americans are, oh, oh, so close, so, they had better privileges. Thanks, Jeff. In other news, thousands of, <laughs> told you it wasn't that easy. <laughs> thousands of African, okay, got it. Thank you, Jeff. In other news, thousands of thousands of thousands <laughs> thousands <laughs> thousands. Okay. In other news, for a jest. I forgot. Else and shipyards. <laughs> I just feel. I was like still. Commissions.
Sorry. So, like steel mills? Like steel mills. Like steel mills. Hold on. How should I reword that? I don't think you can. African Americans. Because that's the name of it. Steel mills. War efforts for war wounds are able to find jobs such as domestic helpers and farm laborers. Although they are playing a big part in our society today, African Americans are facing a lot of discrimination abroad and at home. And the government. Training camps. Um, oh. Training camps. 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 Terrible. <laughs> um, <laughs> extremely terrible. <laughs> are you recording? What are your views on the riots? Um, it's very horrible, sir. It's uh really, really horrible. <laughs> I know. Uh, <laughs> Horrible, and um, we have all this discrimination going on, and war. Okay. <laughs>